Hey everybody, Ryan here again from Chomp, and today I'm just talking about a free add-on that I made because one of the things that I sort of miss in my transition from Blender to Sim 4D is just a fast way to do a play blast or a quick animation preview. So I'll leave a link in the description, but I made a free add-on, and I'm gonna show you really quick how I've been using it on some of our client work. So here's an example of one of the scenes where we kind of got a few things happening here. We have these stack of cards with the cloner, some foliage with the trees, and if I press play, we're getting kind of a low frame rate because there's just sort of a lot going on in the scene. And we're also using cycles. So to kind of get the animation timing of this, we just need a quick render, gray render. We just want to know what it looks like and just see what the timing is. And then if you don't see any of your plugins or add-ons over here, you just hit the end key and it's going to be right down here. And we have our little window. And here we can just quickly select our settings of what we want to see our play blast to be. So maybe you want 1280 by 720 just to get a quick preview. Low quality is fine. This might default to another folder, but you can go ahead and click the folder icon and select wherever you would like to save your play blast. Right now I'm saving mine just at the desktop and it's going to default here to play blast underscore. I'm just going to call this house and cards. And maybe you don't want to see all this, so we're going to go ahead and just go to our shaded view here. Let's turn off some of the overlays, and I'm going to hit Play Blast. And you'll see some of the frames are populating, and they're loading into memory right now, and it's thinking. And all this is going off of is your output settings. There's no need to change any of your EXR setup or go over to the FFmpeg settings or do anything for different for video it's going to automatically just go off of the frame rate that you have set for your project. Once it's done, you'll get a little message down here that uh, your play blast started. And this is just resetting all your settings to what they were before. So let me go ahead and open up. We just have an MP4 of our settings so we can quickly see what our play blast is looking like. So again, I'll leave a link for that add-on down in the description. It's free, download it, test it out, and feel free to let me know any features or anything else you'd like to see in this and maybe we can kind of update this together as we test it out. So, quick one today. Thanks again guys and as always, I'll see you in the next video. Have a great one.